Hello, how you doing? My name is uh, Vic Duva. I am the Director of Corporate Staffing at CT Corporation. I've been with CT for 35 years, uh, and I've been the Director of Corporate Staffing since 2003. Well, an independent director is part of the board of directors of a special purpose entity. Now, a special purpose entity is uh, set up uh, during the uh, financial transaction, which is usually a uh, commercial real estate property. And that special purpose entity is set up for uh, purposes of managing the loan. And an independent director, uh, we sit on that board. Uh, we do not have any fiduciary responsibilities, but our main responsibility is that uh, to vote on a bankruptcy if required to do so. Why would someone need to be, need an independent director? Well, the lender is going to require it. The key characteristics of a independent director and something to look for is someone you can trust. Uh, that would be first and foremost because they have to remain in, independent between the lender and the borrower. Along with that, if you're looking for somebody that's going to be able to do that, there's a responsibility involved. If the loan doesn't go according to plan and a bankruptcy vote is required, you're looking for somebody that has a workflow in place that reviews all aspects of the bankruptcy, or the proposed bankruptcy, I should say, and knows how to handle it and would vote accordingly. Don't make your decision based on price. Base it on their experience, their responsibility. That's what you're looking for. And also, you know, cost sometimes uh, is very deceiving. <laughs>